Hey guys, and welcome to Vanguard Tactics. I'm Stephen. I'm Aaron. And we are going to be playing a almighty battle report today with the big guns never tire. Yep, Clash of the Titans. Clash of the Titans, Imperial Knights and some Imperial Guard. Yep. Versus the Chaos Knights in this 2000 point live stream game. We've also got Jake on the deck. How are you doing, Jake? I'm well, thank you. How are you? Yep, doing well, mate. And thank we've you. also got Joe here who is busily painting. So Joe is here, don't worry, guys. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> and um, so again, saw Aaron play at the weekend using yeah. your orcs. I did, yeah, using the orcs. Got something a bit different now. Yep, so a bit different. You played against the new Jakari, didn't you? I did, yeah. So yeah. I can't wait for this game. I just wanted to push some big models around. Exactly. I think that's what it's all about today. Whatever the result is, there's going to be some... Uh, some big damage going through. Yeah, and again, once again, thank you to all of our sponsors, C Studios, Entoyment, Foreground, and JW Wargaming. And it's a great way to support this show is by obviously using our sponsors in the description below. Now, both of our links for the, or sorry, both of our lists are gonna be in the link below where you can check out that blog page and both of them are gonna be written out. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over absolutely everything, the list, the mission, the table, all that kind of good stuff. So it's gonna give you a really good idea of what this game is gonna look like today. Now at Vanguard Tactics, we play the game how we feel it should be played. So we're going to be doing loads of go-backs, take-backs. We have some coaching moments as well. Um, and it's all about playing the game with true sportsmanship and fair play possible whilst having a bit of a laugh and banter throughout. So, um, yeah, we do have a very dry sense of humour on the show. So if you've got one too, you're going to love it. It's all going to be good. So should we go for the mission first? Yeah, why not? So Jake, if you can bring the mission up. So this mission today is Scorched Earth. Scorched Earth, yep. Dawn of War deployment, so the long edges, as you can see. And uh, yeah, it's essentially six objectives. Mm -hmm. And you'll score five points if you hold one. Ten points if you hold two. A further five points if you hold two. And then another five points if you hold more than your opponent. It's going to be tough today, I think. I've only got six models. You've got a few more than me, but not that many more. Mm. Um, so that's the primary mission. Obviously, that's capped at 15 points per battle round, 45 points for the entire game. And then each of us are going to score 10 points because we have battle-ready armies or battle-painted armies. And then we're going to pick secondary missions. So we've already picked those. You'll see those later after we've covered the list. We'll go into why we've covered those or picked those, should I say. So next up, let's cover the table and the terrain. So in terms of this layout, what you can see is the following. We've got some massive ruins on the table, which will be giving obscuring to some of these smaller knights and also your infantry models. Yeah, indeed. But obviously the big boys ain't getting anything. They're not getting a look no. in on terrain today. The river that goes down the center is going to give a minus two move if you have to move across it. Okay. So just bear that in mind. And then obviously we've got the dense areas of terrain as well. So there'd be minus one to hit if you're a little knight or infantry, but big knights, nothing. Not much. So that's how we're playing it today. If it looks a little bit tight moving knights around, we don't want any of the terrain to impact moving models. So we're just going to say, yeah, you can move through there, no problem. They're massive titans. They're probably the things that's torn the city down. So we're not going to let, you know, maybe half a centimeter of terrain to block a movement. We're just going to play nice and fast for you guys today and have you know we never want that situation to be up in the game right you don't want to be penalized because you've took your favorite army i exactly. think um so yeah that is pretty much everything so we'll go over um actually we'll go over aaron's list first yeah sure there you go i'm gonna to have to look at my phone for you this carry on, mate. Well, yeah the, the guys um, are looking at the picture at the moment so ah, cool. you can carry Excellent. on Free He's got reign. free reign to do what you want. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, so obviously the you big. To, you don't need to swear at him, Aaron. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, so we've got the uh, the super heavy. Um, that's obviously the the main detachment for this. Uh, that's where my warlord's going to be. So uh, we're in there. We've got two special knights, the Questorus Knight Megara, and I think we've had uh, a few people that really wanted to get this on the show. Yeah. Uh, Kylo this afternoon actually helped me out a li little bit with this list, putting yep. it together. So one of our students, well, Kylo, um, yeah. yeah, he's helped you out with the list, which is cool. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Um, so yeah, within uh, within this list, we've got the uh, the two big Megaras. Now I've put a disc uh, next to the first one. That's the one with uh, Ion Bulwark, uh, which is the four plus in bomb, mm. the Warlord trait, uh, and it's also got the uh, the yeah. Helm Dominatus. Okay, which 
basically within six inches of him, yeah. plus one to hit for armages. Wow. Yeah, so the armages oh, melters. I see what you've are, done here. Yeah, I see. Armages and melters are, are hitting, on, uh, hitting on twos. Brilliant. Yeah. Great. Yeah. So, yeah, that's, I like uh, that. that's that one. What and about then, your other knight? Has he got a wall or trait? He has. Now, this whole detachment is crassed, which, uh, as we know, probably, it uh, gives us reroll hit rolls in combat. Mm -hmm. That's not the main thing, really. No. The main thing for that is that we've got the, uh, the Headsman's Mark. Oh, I love it. It's actually the crass knight that made this channel famous. So I used to run it with my Death Watch. Ah, that was okay. originally what I kicked off this channel with, nice. was with my mixed Death Watch. And also I used to run a crass knight nice. with the uh, Headsman's Mark and First Knight. So you reroll once to wound. Yep. And also, uh, sorry, real ones to hit. hit. Sorry, yeah. not wound. And then you get extra damage against vehicles or titans, right? Exactly. Very good relic. Love exactly. it. Okay, cool. So what else have you got in that list? Yep. So uh, we've also got um, a unit of three war glaives yep. with, uh, with melter guns. A unit of two war glaives with melter guns. They've also got the thermal spear, which is their main gun. Yep. Decent uh, D3 shot melter gun. Um, we've also got one unit. Uh, which is this one here, uh, the um, the free blade. So that's why he's got his, uh, his hazard stripes. Hazard stripes, exactly. So um, yeah, basically he's got uh, exiled in shame and obsessive vengeance. So basically you can't use a stratagem on him or anything like that. Um, and you also have to shoot at the closest enemy target. Is that if the damnation kicks in? Exactly. Well, what's his pact? What does he? What's his benefit? He gets? His benefit is that he uh, he's got sworn to a quest. Which right. is the one that allows him basically, um, he's got obsec and cannot, you cannot take him off. It doesn't matter the amount of models you've got on that objective. Oh. He takes off of you. Nice. Very good. So yeah, it's a cheeky little bit of tech, which, okay. is, uh, which is quite cool. Love yeah. it. Uh, and then going to, uh, to the Scions, uh, we've got a, det a patrol detachment of the Iotan Gorgonas. I think I've maybe said that right. Not go sure. with it. Go, with, go it. with it. We'll go with it. Move on. Exactly. So we've got a Tempest or Prime, Bolt Pistol and Power Sword in there. Love it. Uh, we've got three units of Scions, uh, unit of five, unit of five and a unit of seven. Cool. Unit of seven is on the board. The other two are up in the air. Okay. Uh, and the, the main thing about this detachment really is that for one CP I can deep strike within five inches. Yeah. Okay. Which is, again, really nice bit of tech. Um, goes hand in hand with uh, Deploy Scramblers. Yep. Um, a little bit scared of uh, these non-line of sight shooting. Yep. To be honest, mm -hmm. but we'll, we'll cross that bridge when when we come to it. Um, yeah, they also uh, get exploding sixes, um, but yeah, that's not really going to come into play here. No, love it. Nice. Yeah, that that is uh, that your is list. Good. Secondaries. What have you gone for? I have gone for engage on all fronts. Uh, I've got a lot of fast moving units that can uh, hopefully get in there, and I've also got those deep striking. Uh, uh, Scions that can score me some extra points. Yep. Um, I've also gone for Bring It Down. Yep. Rather than Titan Hunters. Mm -hmm. um, we're just thinking that it's uh, even though killing one knight nets me ten points, killing two nets me twelve. Yeah. Actually, by uh, incrementally killing the, the few different points uh, models, we can get some more points on the board. So yeah, we get two points for killing each of the uh, Armager Warglaves and the uh, the Helverins. Three points for the others. Yeah. And uh, yeah, three points for the big ones. Nice, okay, cool. And then you've gone for the third one, which is scramblers, isn't it? Exactly, yeah. deploy scramblers. Yeah, so get it in those different quarters or different areas of the table. Um, yeah, your deployment, middle and the end, not quarters, because that's engage. Yep. Um, and then my secondaries, or I'll go through my list now, if you can bring up my list, that'd before, be great. Before we do real quick, we yep. do have a super chat. Oh, yes. Uh, sure. $15 from Robert Welsh. He just said, what's up, guys? Hope you're all doing well. No question again, just supporting you. But what's up, guys, is a question. And we're doing well. Yeah, so we are doing you. well, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah really good. Yeah, yeah, I'm a lot more relaxed. I had a pretty chill day yesterday. Nice. I needed a day to chill because, obviously, the week of Drakari buried me and Joe into the ground. So, um, yeah. yeah, we are... Yeah, it's going to be nice just to play a nice chilled game tonight. Yeah. yeah. Right, going to... But thank you so much, Robert. So, um, okay, my list. You've seen this list before, potentially. Tweaked it slightly... And what we've got is three big knights, four little knights. We've got the big knights. Um, I've got a 
One which has got double thermal. This is the Dragon Knight. He's got double thermal, and then he's also got the big missiles on top. Mm. Okay, so he's like my anti-vehicle killer, anti Death Shroud, Rhinos. He's my one pumps. Yeah, straight in the strawberry basket. That's him. Then we've got um, another knight who's the Warlord, and he's got objective secured, Warlord trait. Um, he's also got inbuilt Val, which gives him transhuman physiology, essentially. So you can't wean him on a one, two, or three. Mm -hmm. And he's got the core knight rule, which means once per game, going to combat, no inbun saves. No inbun saves. That's, that's going to be a... Uh... Hmm. Yeah, tasty. Yeah. You think now, like, there's so much stuff like, you know, Death Row Terminators... Um, Deathwing, yep. Morty, you name it, everything's yeah. got an invan. Or mm. even being able to go into a unit of, I don't know, like 10 Harlequins and pick up the unit. Or yeah. um, you don't want to be bogged down by getting stuck into combat with 20 witches. No. Go no. with your stampy feet. Uh, I am Iconoclast. I've gone for Hepatrex, which means I get plus two wounds on all of them. Mm -hmm. um, Iconoclast, I get an extra attack, extra AP with my melee weapons. And then also, um, that's one of the big knights. He's got the ability to shoot indirect. He's got the Avenger. On the other big knight, the one with the pipes, um, he's also got an Avenger, indirect shooting. He is the one that is a Psyker. So mm -hmm. which allows me to cast Smite. Yeah. And it's not that you need to be worried about, but it gives me the option to do psychic actions, which I really like in this list. Mm, nice. Um, and he's also got the... Ability Warlord trait that I can stand back up. So when he dies, he stands back up on a four okay. plus uh, with D three wounds remaining. Tasty. Okay. And which one's that? The one. The the ones with the pipes here. Yeah, got them. And then spikes is my core knight one, you know. And nice. then I've got the dragon, which is the one that breathes fire, and just yeah. Beautiful. And then I've got two armagers or two war dogs, should I say, with the. Mm. Uh, thermals, and I've paid the extra five points for the melter gun on top, Same. and then I've also gone the auto cannons on the other unit, but they don't have the melter guns, okay? So that's my list. My secondaries, I've gone for Psychic Ritual, which is in the centre of the table, yep. and then I've also gone for um, in, uh, Grind Them Down. Mm -hmm. Didn't want to take that one, but I've, I've gone, to, gone for it, and I've also gone for Bring It Down as well. So yeah, that's my secondary picks. Beautiful. I think it's going, mm. to be, uh, it's going to be an interesting game. Now remember guys, all your super chats always goes to help produce much better channels or for you in the future. And if you ever want to donate a, or if you want to be honoured as a player on the table, then if you donate the right amount of money for the box set that you want to be honoured in, then we will add your name, your YouTube name to that model once we've built and painted it. Okay, so just so you guys know where the money goes. Um, anyway. And obviously, we'll only stop the game for Super Chat questions. So if you have a burning question you want us to answer, get it Super Chatted in. Um, right. I think that's everything, mate, isn't it? We missed anything, Jake? I think we're all ready to go. Yeah? People, well, what's the money on? Is it on the Chaos or the Imperial Knights? It's, it's literally just split yeah? in half. Oh. Um, I think this is going to be a great game. Let's hope. Big can, roll. Steve is already Fingers stressing. Crossed. I'm stressing <laughs> already. I'm stressing about this roll. It's a we're, big roll. Right, we're going to jump to the overhead now. You want first turn or second? I not, need, that, not that you get the pick. Yeah. But no, I, I think I need first. What are you rolling? A white dice? Are we rolling a big one? Uh, okay, you roll a big black one. I'll roll a big black one as well, and then it'll be sharp easier. You go first. Two. Oh. A two. No. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm really good at rolling ones. One. But I feel like today is going to be a six. I've actually got real good history of going first on stream. Okay. It's a one. It's a one! It's a one! <laughs> it's a one! He's only gone and the done sigh it. of relief, honestly. Wow. Why Excellent. is that big for you? Just explain to the guys why that is a big role. So, coming into this game, I, uh, I had a big decision to make with the Deploy Scramblers. Um, and I realised just before that you've got a lot of indirect shooting. Yeah. And I only have two units in Deep Strike, and one unit sat under here. Yeah. And I think it was safe to say they're probably going to get mulched if uh, I didn't get first. Yeah. Or you'd, have so, to, or you'd have to spend two CPs to auto pass more if I didn't kill them all. Auto yeah. pass, I could do take cover because I'm not sure what minus the negative is on Minus that. one, I think. Minus one. So minus one. realistically, they probably would have survived. Yeah. But it was, I don't, like to, I don't like to risk that. And no. it's probably 
yeah, I wouldn't suggest making that choice. And uh, yeah, and that's that's exactly the target I need to get rid of is those guys that exactly. are potentially doing that scramble because then I can just knock off ten points. So I'm kind of happy that it's gone this way because I think that otherwise I don't want to feel like I've got a ten point lead if I had a good first turn. Exactly. Yeah. No, so it's going to be a good game. It's just got to make sure they don't kill me too hard now. Okay. Yeah. Right. Yeah, we'll anyway, see what we can do. Hey? Yes. So your. Obviously, command phase. Command phase. Just get a CP, don't you? Yeah, exactly. Do you so want to keep a little... You've got a die over there for your CPs, yeah. yeah. So that'll put me up to uh, nine command points. I started off with eight. Yeah, I'm on the same. So, mate, move away. Let's do it. Right, so... Let's have a good game. Yeah, good game. Good luck, have fun. Um, so, first things first, I'm going to get this uh, get this knight up the table. I want to try and get some engaged Oh, points. before we start, I've got to do my damnations in packs. Ah, so um, I've declared to go for the six-inch heroic intervention. Yeah. Okay, but my um, damnations, I'm going to roll for, and obviously we're going to have to roll for yours as well, for aren't mine we? As well, yeah, exactly. So we'll see what my damnation is. It's a two. So I'm going to have a quick look what that is. Um, a two is. Basically, I cannot fall back and have a ballistic skill of a six plus. Obviously, if we fail your leadership. Then I'm only hitting on sixes. Uh, it's not good. Yeah. Um, but you, do your damnation kick in or not? Are you good? Um, so I need to roll 2d6 two two against leadership. And be under your leadership, basically. And be under yeah. my leadership. Cool. Double one. Double one. That's a great start. I think you're clean. I think yeah, you're good. Yeah, we are yeah. good. Let's not have that for some charges later on, maybe. Yeah. Cool. Right. Let's, um, if you're uh, happy to go, let's get some... Some movement down. Yeah, and I roll for the start of your turn, so I'll roll at the start of my turn, okay? Oh, excellent. Right, so I'm going to advance this one down the side. Yep. Um, big five. Big five, so that's going to be nice. That's going to get me that engage point. I just needed to get over this line. So. While you do that, we have a super chat. Go on. It's Ooh. five pounds from Kylo. Yep. I don't need to say any other name. We know who yeah. that is. It's the it's it's really the David versus Goliath match. Can't wait to see some knights on the table. Go BFG. Go Aaron from from the win slash a welcome. Right. <laughs> and apparently they're watching in Discord for you. Oh, bless Hello, them guys. All. So I've gone twelve so far. Oh um, yeah. And I've got another seven. So I'm just gonna tuck in here. So I'm over the line. Yeah. So engage. I'm just. I want to be a little bit back from uh, so from this, so I'm not on the obscuring. But I've got a couple of angles there. A couple of angles. A couple of angles. Now, this guy's going to move forward. He's got his normal 12-inch move, so he's going to move forward a little bit. I don't want to just give you some free charges. Have you got any advances and charges? I think Stratums, I do. You do so. I think I've got that stratagem. I don't know if I'll ever use it, but I think I do have it. I will tell you, though. I'm going to have a look now. Cool. I haven't... Full tilt, yep. Excellent. Two CPs. So, Essentially, I, I don't want to give you a free charge Gosh. through there, so I'm not going to go straight forward. Yep, makes sense. This one here, going to go uh, advance forward just to try and maybe get another one. He's not going to do that, so he's just going to sit. Um, he's got 15 inches of movement. Good movement, isn't it? It that is. These guys, team. exactly. These guys have got a lot, so he's just going to go over here um, and through this because this guy over here, he, he's obscured. Yeah. But because I can see that target, that mm -hmm. it's not going to be an issue. Um, yes, because he's uh, got the yeah. The titan. If you can see right, uh, you still need to be able to draw a line of sight. So, so let's just get down underneath there. I don't know if you can. Uh, yeah, through this window. So we're looking through this window onto this big night. Okay. Underneath there, up through there. Okay. I think we probably can see through there. Right. Um, we are going to have to start getting onto a couple of objectives. Mm -hmm. So this guy's just going to move. Uh, he's got 14 inches. He could try and get that extra engage point. Um, yeah, because that'll give you a little bit of move blocking as well. So I'm going to advance uh, this, this knight here. Yep. He gets four, so he's 18 inches. So 18 from the back is not, again, going to get us over that line. Um, so I'm just going to move and just tie onto this objective here. Yep. And that will leave a nice little bit of move block in here as well to stop things from necessarily getting through. Um, and then what we'll do, I think, 30 inches to this night, 30 to that night. 
So I want to be around this space here with the rest of my knights, mm -hmm. so they can see and target a couple of knights for that uh, rotate that's probably going to happen. Yeah. So he's going to move up. So with just with the obscuring. Sure. Is this building, if you're completely behind it, is that not obscuring you? It's obscuring me from you, but I can see through it because this guy here has got um, the, the, the big knights don't take the benefit because they're over 18 wounds. Yeah, okay. They don't get obscuring. Okay, cool. So yeah. I can see straight through, Okay. but yeah. you can't necessarily see Because there's a window me. here, yeah? Because there's a window, Yeah. I can see straight through. I don't need to stand on it. Cool, love it. Um, what we'll also do, send this knight forwards onto this objective. So we have at least a couple knights on here. And if you see what we're doing there is we're, the reason why I'm asking these questions for Aaron is so that you guys at home can know what we're doing. Yeah. And also it's really good to declare that now, because if we, for example, found out that you couldn't shoot, you could move him back a bit so you could still get it. Exactly. So it's yeah. always good to declare what you're doing and why you're doing it and for your opponent to then have their opportunity to challenge it before it matters rather exactly. than a gotcha moment later on in the game. So it's always good just to be really clear. We like to talk everything through on stream, again, to keep you guys involved as to what we're doing because there's going to be a whole multitude of people that are just learning 40K mm -hmm. that watch our streams and people who obviously play a lot more as well. So exactly. it's good to cover all those bases. Okay, mate. Perfect. So I've got my, uh, my one guy there that uh, can get the engage. I haven't got the... the uh, Three points. Scrambling here, Bunny Charles? Scrambling down there, exactly. Yep. Um, don't want to be forgetting that. We've got, uh, these guys have just moved up, so they've got a uh, 30 inch range. Let's just double check that one. Um, Is he just out of that okay. one? I think he's just out of that one, but that's okay. We're gonna start, we're gonna start around there anyway. Yep. Um, yeah. I think I'm pretty happy with that. Okay, but he's obviously gonna be within 30 of that 30 one. 30 right of there. that one, yeah, he's 30 of a couple. So, it's always nice to try and get a couple of um, take, targets yeah. for them because you, you obviously want to be baiting a little bit out. Mm -hmm. um, and right, let's see what happens. This could be horrible. Let's see what we can do, hey? This is a lot of melter guns. Yeah, so this guy, just to confirm as well, because you've, uh, I can see through there. I'll just draw, take a little, it's quite useful just to take a tape measure. Yeah. Um, just to sort of confirm that you can see because um, it's a nice, easy way to, yep. so he can see straight through there. Okay. Uh, so we're going to start, mate. You've got no psychic phase. No psychic phase, no. So um, I'm going to start where we can only see one target. Okay. So we'll go with this one over here. He has yep. advanced. So these front two did advance. Yeah. So we're going to shoot over uh, over this, uh, your, your wall or not? This one here, yeah? Yeah, that's the one. Okay, so I'm going to rotate iron shields, okay? Rotate, excellent, cool. So that gives me that four plus invulnerable save. Cool, right, so I've got D3 shots on this one. Mm -hmm. uh, the big three. Nice, and are you getting plus one to hit or not? Uh, no, because I'm outside of six inches, so cool. these guys will get plus one to hit, but, but this guy's going to be hitting on a four. Okay, cool. Cool. So, hitting on, uh, hitting on fours because we advanced. We've got two hits, very nice. And this is going to be wounded on fours because it's strength eight versus yep. stuff like that. Cool, we've, uh, we've got one. Oh, oh first one. He's a go. five, he's good. Are we going in the tray? Oh, we can go in the tray, mate. Yeah, we can we'll go, go in the tray. It's a five. We're all good. We're fives today, mate. Yeah, fives today. We're fives. Yeah. Excellent. Cool, right, nice. So, Ooh, uh, one down. Yeah, he's... Uh, <laughs> exactly. So, so he's, uh, he's also the one that can stand up, isn't he? He is the one that can stand up. Yeah. But he's obviously got that four up. And again, I wanted to put it on that one because more of, the, of your models are in range of that one. Yeah. And again, this is my one that could do psychic actions. So yeah. if I can't get those psychic actions off, then yeah, yeah. obviously we're in a bit of trouble there. Exactly, exactly. So yeah, this one was not in range of, of, uh, of this one. So but going on the same night, yeah? I think he's yeah, going to go on the same night. D3 shots. And did he advance one. as well? Uh, he didn't, no. He no. was just sat in here. So that's... Uh, this one here did, right? This one here at the front did, yeah. 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 Okay, cool. So, so we've done this one. This, this one's, one's hitting on a two. This one's hitting on a two, exactly. Yep. So one shot. He's hit on that two, so that's already making a difference. And on a four. No, absolutely not. That's uh, that's all good. Now the rest of them are in range of uh, of this knight. Oh, not the corn one. Yeah. Okay, it's Mr. So. Spikes. Mr. Spikes, exactly. <sighs> okay. I've spent a CP, Jake. If you could please take that off me. It was already seven. already done. Awesome. Seven. All right, come on, fives. I need to roll now. Let's uh, let's see what this guy can do. It's not with the big boy. It's okay. the big guy. That's the, the big guy. Now I'm not sure. 
So he's got a little gun that's a 24 inch range. That is yeah, in range. Yeah, yeah, he's all good. Um, so yeah, I think we're going to put everything into that. Okay. So the uh, the lightning, we've got um, eight shots. Okay. All right. All right. Now these get two additional hits. Wow. On sixes. On sixes. Okay. And you're re-rolling ones because you're a first knight. Re-rolling ones. Because mm -hmm. of the first night. And it's two extra damage per gun. It's strength seven, so. We're so on fives. We're on fives, but. Yeah. Minus two, so you're on your inbound. Okay. No problem. You carry on. Let's get those six here, please. Oh, he's got There's two. Some. There's, There's a some. There's a one there. There's a one. Re -roll Let's re-roll that, that. Five. So nice. you may as well just leave those two in, do not you? Leave those two in, and, and you'll get another two for that other six. Okay. Right. Right. These now, are fives now. You're fives to end. Okay. Oh. Oh. Try that again. It's tense. It's tense. The it's moon tense. is tense. It's not very good. There's one there. I see really one. Really not very good. I think I may have got away I with think that. You have got away with it. It's not like right. me to do that. One wound. Okay. Unfortunately. Minus two though. Yeah. Minus two. Come on, I'm a five. Big five. Big five. It's a five. Oh. oh. That, that would have been five damage, that. Oh, blood for the blood god. That's yeah. what, you know, that's what you've got to say, apparently. Exactly. Blood for the blood god. Blood for the blood god. We but all not, have, not mine, not my blood. We all have our own chance, so you've got to come up with an Aaron. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. It's, it's wild, really, isn't Has it? Has he got any other guns? Yeah, he's got that, uh, the rapid fire one. Does he get rapid fire at max range? Oh, no, that's, um, no, that's, that's, space a, that's a space marine thing, isn't it? Mm. So that we two shots. Not a space marine. He is yeah. not a space marine. He's, he's, yeah. he's a big boy, but he's not a space marine. He's so not that good. Gets that um, two hits. Yep. And this will be five to wound again. Nothing. Nothing. Oh. Okay. Sad. Sad. I think that we got away with that a little bit. Okay. Got away with that a little bit. You did. Right. Let's, uh, let's move on to this one. Okay. So I'm pretty sure he's going to be out of the twenty-four. Might be. Uh, yeah, he looks like he's, he looks like he's out. Yeah, because yeah, you haven't moved past your deployment zone. No, no. And I've, obviously, I haven't moved out of mine. Yet. So we got the uh, we got the same thing again, but not quite as damaging. So we've got the eight shots again coming from this guy into uh, into this one over here. Okay. Okay. Yeah, love it. Uh, hitting on threes, and we've got some more explosions again. So we'll yep. leave these in. But no re-rolls this time, right? No re-rolls. So we haven't got the re-roll ones here mm -hmm. because that was uh, for the first night. So we'll yep. put another two on the table there. And then let's hope we get some more fives here. That would be... Hopefully not. Really good. Oh. Okay, that's... Uh, I wish I had it the other way around, but I cannot complain about that. Five saves. Five saves. Okay. I've made three oh, in made three. What's the damage? It's three each. Three each. So I've six lost damage. six. So I'm now down to um, 20 because I start with two additional wounds. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So I'll put a six on me so I know I've lost six. Yeah. Okay. Cool. We'll go with this one over here. Yep. Uh, he also advanced, so he's hitting on a four. Which knight you've shown us? So this is the free blade down yep. in the... And who's uh, he shooting at? The same so target? So he's shooting at the same target. Same target. Um, okay. So we've got that kind of cross paths yep. shooting. So uh, D3 shots. Yep. It's a big three again. Big three. And he's hit on fours. Two hits. I, I was just checking a rule from, from the chat. Don't okay. worry. <laughs> and two wounds. Two wounds, yep. Oh, both gone through. Both have gone through. Do I CP reroll one? What have you got left to shoot? Just I have got three more. Three more nights. Okay, carry on. Carry on? Mm -hmm. Right, I better do these one at a time because uh, so if you want to reroll one of them, then uh, it's best to do that way. Yeah. Uh, a five, I'll wow. take that. And another five. I'm not re-rolling any of those. No, probably not going to, are you? No. no. Ten damage. Ten damage. Wow. Okay. That's not gone well. Mm. Down another. I've lost 16 wounds so far. So eight left. Okay. Right, next right. one then, mate. Let's get, let's get through let's this. Let's get this going. D3 shots. One. Okay. On a two. He's hit. He's hit. It's a wound. It's a wound. When we're obviously rolling, just swap over to that top down cam for them to see, yeah? When we're, just when we're rolling, obviously when we're not, put it back to us, okay, Jake? Uh, so what is that? Yeah? That's wounded on a four. 
Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Big five. No. Carry on. Six. Aaron, what is wrong it with is you? It is going off. What is like wrong with dice. you? I like this dice. Wow, what is wrong with you, man? Yeah. It's disgusting, Rolling. Okay. Happy days, happy days. All right, two left. Right, second one. Two shots. Let's okay. have this. Hitting on a two. No. Two hits. Two hits. Two wounds. Two wounds. What is this? Aaron, we're, we're meant to have been a nice friendly game here. Hey. And they've both gone through. They've I've both only gone got, um, how many wounds have I got left now? You've got two, I think. I've got two wounds left. Uh, well, I mean, there's no point CP re rolling. So. Um, you start on 26, so if you took 16, that would be Oh, okay. 10. So you've got an extra couple of wounds. So I've got four left. Four left. I'm going to CP re roll it. Cool. Because then if you roll under a four, I need to CP then you need to CP re-roll it. And I've got one left that's the one that... And it uh, means you're going to have to put your last one on him as well. And he advances as well, so um, he'll be hitting on a three. Come on. Uh, how many... I'll be taking down a six CPs. Sure, go, yeah, let's go for it. Big five. Yes! He's, done he's it. called it! He's done have it. A blood god! Four wounds left. Yeah. He's done it. What's wrong with you? Explode! Like, honestly. Exploding, sweet, glorious. No, maybe well, not. he's gone. He's gone. I tried. I tried my best, guys. We've Mr. killed a knight in a turn. Mr. Obsec is gone. Happy days. That was bad. Happy, happy days. This has not gone well. Okay. Cool. I mean, I've that... got. Uh, that'll, get you some points that'll get me three points on Bring It Down, that one, Well, I think I got a little bit lucky there. I can't, can't lie. We, well, we whiffed with this. I mean, your damage was good, yeah. It was huge. Yeah. yeah. So we've got the one more left that's uh, hitting on a three because he advanced, but he's got the plus, uh, plus from this guy. Yep. Um, he is going to fire it into your Warlord. Yep. Why not? Uh, three shots. Hitting on threes. They will hit. They will hit. Wind on fours. Oh, two wounds. Two four ups. One's gone through. One's gone through. Six damage. What is this? I'm just going to say, they're not my dice. What is this? <laughs> what is this? I bet you right. wish Joe was here now, don't you? Oh, wow. <laughs> what a turn. That was big, mate. That was huge. Yeah, yeah. I think um, definitely say that the luck was on my uh, side there. Mm, I started off well with some saves, and then your damage is woo, huge. And it's huge. big. It is big when you start losing big nights. Right, okay, yeah. so I'm going to gain a CP. So I go back up to seven. Uh, does my damnation, or I mean, it doesn't even matter now because he's dead, so mm -hmm. that, uh, that damnation doesn't even matter anymore. So I need yep. to worry about rolling that out. Um, so on to my turn one. Oh dear. Mm. Oh dear, oh dear. Aaron. Hello. Do you know the, the hell mainly effect? You, so you pick a knight within 24. You pick a model unit within 24, and then all these oh, armages. Okay. So do you want to take that, just take that six off? It's basically so that the helm only works on one unit, so you oh, declare right. it. Oh, okay. That's what I was checking. Uh, and I couldn't apologies, find it. So apologies, apologies, apologies. Right. You rolled so you freeze. Can, you that can take, one would miss. You can take that off. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah? Yeah, take that off. That's very sporting of you. That's yeah. Good. Nah, this is, uh, so this is a brand new list to me, um, so these things happen. Um, I get two points for engage, uh, and I've got the uh, one on scramblers. Um, plus the three, four. Oh, he's coming out to play. I've got him, haven't I? I've got to play aggressive now. Yeah. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Got to play aggressive. Can't be dilly dallying, you know? Yeah. So just to get within six of the centre there, okay? Cool. Steve, yep. you know how you were sad because your knight died? Yeah. Do you want me to make you feel a bit better? What's that? We have a super chat. Oh, yeah. See? <laughs> um, $5 again from Robert Welsh. He has said, I was just wondering, what is the best kit or way to paint models? I have a good amount of Grey Knight models I need to paint. What would you suggest? Um, let me just go around to the other side. So what's the question again? So just to reiterate, we've, mm -hmm. so he was just wondering, what is the best... Best kit or way to paint models? I have a good amount of Grey Knight models I need to paint. What was your? What would be your suggestion? So just start general tips to just getting into painting, to be honest. Okay, so Grey Knights are great, obviously. Um, what I would do with Grey Knights is get them all built. 
get them on like a nice yard stick as it were, blue tack mm -hmm. them all down, okay? And then what I would do is basically spray the entire things black, okay? Then get a white. And what you're gonna do is if they're like out like this on this stick here, you're just gonna get the can, so they're all gonna be black, and then you're gonna get the can of white from one angle and just all the way down. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's what we call a xenophore highlight. Yep. Then what you're gonna do is basically get a silver can, and hopefully it's just, you don't wanna go too close, you wanna do nice light coats or from distances, and you're basically gonna go over one light coat because then what's gonna happen is the silver that hits the white is gonna mm -hmm. be a little bit shinier than it is on the black, okay? So then what you're gonna end up with is basically the nice contrast in silvers even before you've done anything else. Yeah, yeah. So you go all over with the silver nice and light from a good distance, do it again, make sure there's a good covering, and then, yeah, from that point, just a nice, um, like, blue glaze. Mm -hmm. Really, wa we're, not water it down, but use uh, the medium, Lafayette medium. Use lots of that, and then literally just go over the, the silver armour with that blue. That's going to give you a really nice, kind of, like, bluey, silvery effect. And then get a real nice dry brush then. Um, to makeup brushes work great as dry, dry brushes as well. Take most of the paint off, literally, so you can barely see anything. Good little test is when you rub it against your skin, you can just see, uh, like where you can see the cracks in your skin, just like the tops of yeah. being actually silver. Uh, and that needs to be a lighter silver than the silver that you've used on the models. Go all the way, all the way over that, over just looking to pick out the edges and then get a bit of like contrast black and just go in like the crevices in the center here. Uh, any sort of deep areas go on there just to bring out all the sort of definition. And then use contrast reds to go into, put some, bring out some of the details and gold and then you're gonna be pretty much uh, good to go with those grey nights. That's super simple, five, six different steps. That is your two minute masterclass. That's how a two to, minute, yeah. How to paint grey nights. Yeah. <laughs> So I'll go back over what I've done here. So I've moved this knight forward here just to get myself within 18 inch range so I can get extras on me um, uh, melters. Yep. This guy then can charge this one and hopefully kill him here. Um, you have obviously can interrupt somewhere, yeah. which is gonna be a big problem if you yeah. do decide to do that. Um, but I do need to get rid of this knight as well. So I'm hopefully gonna get a charge off there. I've put this knight within six so I can make sure I can get my psychic action off this turn. Yep. Um, and then what we've got is this one here. Oh, I need to leave, ideally, mm, 14 is with minus two is only 12 inches. So we're gonna go for it anyway, but I'm not gonna be able to get onto that objective. I'm gonna leave this knight back. Again, just to get myself within, is there a range of their guns, 18? Uh, it's 30 inch on the main gun. Oh, okay, so I'll stay within 15 then of that one so I can get double up on the melters. Yep. And then this armature can just sit there to hide from that one. Yep. Um, no, do I want to do that? No, not really. I need to start putting more shots onto this one as well, I think. want plenty of options here. Or obviously see that knight over there. Okay. Cool. So I need to start getting rid of all your melters, I think. Yeah, they did some damage. They did. They absolutely did work, yeah. Okay, so, kick off with the psychic phase. Do I cast my psychic action? Of uh, perils, great. It's a good start, good start there, Steve. Let's do a couple of these. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna have to see if you re-roll that, obviously. Yeah. It's an eight, it's gone off. Whew, psychic so now, ritual, um, one done. If you're casting that, can you then go on to shoot and do other stuff? Yes, cool. you can still psychic, the only thing you can't do is fall back and do a psychic action. Cool. That's the only um, stipulation, um, or fallback in caster power, sure, yeah. Sure, um, Okay, so, I can't believe I've had to spend a CP on that already. Right, mm. so what are we gonna start off with? Um, let's go with the, we'll go with this war dog here. Sure. And we're gonna go with We're gonna put his shots into this knight here, okay? Cool. So he's gonna get his D3 shots, two shots. They've both missed. Then the melter gun. Probably a 12 inch range on the melter gun. Yeah, I'm just out on that one. Do you mind if I just declare yeah, on that one? Is that okay? Yeah, no worries. He 
He's hit though with the melter gun. Wounded with the melter Wounded. gun. Wounded. Five up uh, in von save. Absolutely not. D6 damage. Three. Three. Respectable. Respectable three. Let's have down to nine. Okay, so next up then, we're going to go for this one here is going to then shoot at this one here as well. You've killed one, so I need to kill two units this turn, ideally. What is the charge I need to there? I'm within six, I need a seven inch charge. Okay, so I'm actually going to go for this guy onto this one. Sure. He hits, or oh, two shots, isn't it? Yep. Two hits. Nice. Threes, two go through. Oh. Five ups. Makes one. Makes one. And this is D6. Or is this 2d6 uh, picking the... 2d6 pick the highest on the yeah. thermal. Just two threes, so just a three then. Let's uh, have that one off. And then the melter gun misses. Okay. Ooh. Right, it's not going well so far. This one here then is going to put his shots on there. Cool. So he's going to get the 2d3 shots. Yep, it's 2d3 per gun, I think, isn't it? Yeah, so 43. Hit on threes. It's much better hitting. And then wounding on fours. So that is two, four, six saves, mate. Six, Minus one. Six. Okay, so he is minus one, so yeah, that's gonna be nine nine damage through. So he is dead. Now, does he explode? He yes. does. Yes. Right, so that's going to hurt um, me and then all of you. All of me, yeah, yeah, so. D6 is it? D3 with these ones. Let's have a quick check. Six inches, D3 damage. Is it? You wanted that explosion a bit too much, Aaron, from Steve. Yeah, <laughs> so D3, now. yeah. 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 He's, he's back. So, on bit. me? On you? Three. Oh, it's three, da he's done on three me. to me. Yeah. Okay, cool. On, on me? On you, yeah, that one. Two. Two, yep. Yeah. I'll start putting these black dice down, yeah. So you've taken two on that one. This one here. This one here? Yep. A one. No, a three. Oh. It was going to end at some point. This one here? This one here. Two. So there two, uh, yep. This one here? Two as well. Two again. Okay. Big old explosion. Let's have that gone, one out. Right. So that'll there be... Uh, you took bring it down as well, right? Yep. Right, so, they, two so they've one. all shot. Now we've got the big guy here. Mm. He is going to put... Big thermal knight, sorry. It's going to go on this one here. Cool. So I will rotate this one, because this one without um, bork. I'm going to spend two CPs, mm -hmm. reroll misses. Cool, nice. Okay. I got to see what my top gun goes. It's flat three shots, strength eight minus two, D6 damage. So I'm gonna go for that one first. Cool. Three hits. Cool. Three wounds. Oh, oh. it's tasty. And minus this is two. Uh, on minus four two ups. on my four up, D6 damage. Yeah. He's made them all. You haven't, Aaron. What I've made this? them all. What is this? Okay, right. 2d6 oh. shots from the, um, the big blasters here. Oh, my days. Do you want to reroll that? Reroll that. No, that's so good. It's okay. It's okay. Three, it's just three shots out of the 2d6. Uh, and they've all missed. So I'll reroll those, luckily. All right. Two've hit. Two. One's failed to wound. Have I used a CP this turn? Believe you have oh, in the shooting. How many CPs have I got left now? I have four. Oh, I'm hemorrhaging them. Um, strength nice. I'm winning on threes. I'll CP reroll it. It's a six. Two saves. Okay. These both need to go through. And Come these on. are how much damage? Well, D six plus two because I'm within half range. And you've passed them both. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> All right. That's not gone well. Wow. Yeah, that's not yeah, going well. That's really, 
that's really not not going well that that's how it goes when you use big knights yeah um so next one over there the armature now um okay armager over there is going to shoot this one and no he's, he's there's no point because he's got no other targets apart from this one he's also got a four up but it doesn't matter because he's, he's yeah. on minus one anyway yeah so this one is probably going to be minus one is yeah it? minus one to hit yeah big knights don't get the benefit of dents they don't no of course yeah, yeah it's um right. But you've already taken two wounds here. I'm just going to carry on going on this one because it makes no difference, does cool. it? Okay, so D6 shots on this one. Or two D3 shots. Yeah, getting only the um, the three shots. Yeah, that's really... Average is seven, isn't it? So That was really painful. Yeah, that would uh, could have been a bit better. So wounding on fives. Two saves, mate, on that guy. Two saves. Yeah, flat three each. One's Take gone one. through. Three damage taken. Um, and then we'll just put this one here into there as well. Um, cool. I'll just put everything in. D6 shots, because I'm not going to kill this unit back here, so it's a bit no. pointless. Yeah, sure. Um, I may as well just try and get the two damage through. So the D6 shots from the top gun is one shot. Um, missed. And then the... Uh, cool. Uh, then the Avenger Gatler Gunner, six, nine, twelve. Twelve shots. Hold it. Um, five of miss, so seven of hit, two wounds, mate. Two wounds. Yeah. Save one. Two damage. Up to five. Okay, so charges. Oh. Um, obviously, the charge over there. Cool. Double six, he's gone in. Loves it. This one here, into here. Yeah, so I'm going to do an overwatch on that one. And I failed my charge. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll do the melt again. Yeah. Uh, is not a hit. And the D3 shots is three. Yeah, I'm going to CP reroll my charge. Yeah, sure. Okay, no, I can uh, take that. So I am down to eight CP. Do I CP reroll? How many have I got left, mate? Sure. If you CP this, you'll only have three left. Surely it's worth it for that. How many units down. have I killed this turn to get grind them down? I've killed one so far, haven't I? I'm not guaranteed to kill that one. I'm going to have to try. Um, if you, yes, yeah, so I'll reroll. And I failed it oh, again. Put them in. That's fine. You've had a, you've had a ton of ton of bad rolls and <sighs> gone. Sing it. No, mate. All right. All right. All right. We'll have it is as it is. They not get pluses to charge from your damnation or something. No, no. unfortunately not. Um, so just over there then. Cool. I'll use. I've only got my feet. My stampy feet. Stampy, stampy. Yeah. Oh. I just need to check a wording on something. Okay. Okay. So. I want to know if I get... So I get plus one AP. Yeah. With melee weapons, yeah. And I add one to my attacks characteristic. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to get five attacks, which becomes 15. Four, five. Ten, and then 15. Let's kill it. Oh. How many CPs have I got left? Three. The thing is, if I don't kill him, I don't get grind it down. Are you thinking about spending two to re-roll all hits? Yeah. Yeah. We'll go for it. Do you want to do it? Yeah. Yeah. That's four failed there. And then we're looking for threes. Hold it. <laughs> These are D3 each, right? Yeah. Um, What's that? Yeah. No, yeah, minus three for me, yeah. Uh, so is that seven? That is seven, yeah. Two, four, six. Yeah, seven, mate. Big whiff here, please, Aaron. Minus three. He's rolled two sixes. Two sixes. So five D3. Five D3 damage. So on average, I don't kill him. Come on, Steve. I believe. Six, seven, eight, nine. No, I haven't killed him. Okay, cool. Wow. Right. That's not gone well, has it? No. No. In the grand scheme of not going well. That's no, not that has not well. gone well. Um, okay, so I'm going to give you two propositions. Sure. And I'll, I'll let the guys vote at home. Yeah. Do they want us to re-rack? Yeah. 
because we can talk through what's about yeah, to happen. Absolutely. We can either re rack um, and we, I go first yeah. to see how much that changes the game. Or we, we call this a win to you. Like, so that's we're basically saying Aaron's won this one because we can literally talk through what's going to happen. I don't really have the CPs now to do what I need to. I'm not going to get grind it down because I only killed one and you killed one. Sure. Um, so we can either do that or we can just play on and we can see if I can pull it back. So it's totally up to you guys at home. I wouldn't normally say this, yeah, no. No, but I it's think, been um, quite dire. It's, uh, it's going to be a tough next like, turn. I think losing a knight is probably expected. Yeah. Like, that is what happens. You'd want to so take much one in return. That's yeah, the thing. I'd probably want... Because you've obviously picked up a big knight, and the only thing I've killed is a baby one. Is a baby one. So, um, yeah, this uh, failing the charge here, fa it's perilsing and... Yeah, not it's getting been rid of this It's been a bit point. tough, hasn't it? Yeah. yeah. So what do they want for us to do at home? They haven't said yet, but okay. I think it's just because it's all catching up. It is seven o'clock. And it is a beautiful day. It is a beautiful <laughs> day, yeah. Let's play on then. Let's, Let's play, play on. on. Let's well, play on. Well, give we'll it a few more seconds because obviously it does the YouTube mm -hmm. thing does take. Uh, but you'll, we'll, we'll take your silences just to carry on. But that was mental. That's very... What would you rather do? It's up to you as well. So, um, obviously, I'm thinking time-wise, re-racking might take too long. It might, so. yeah, yeah. I think in that case, for um, time purposes, because you've obviously got to get home. Yeah. If it was a Saturday, maybe we re it. If it was, it. we would, yeah. Um, they want you to play on. They want to play, play on. on. Yeah. Play on it is then. Okay, I've taken cool. JP Wargaming and Kylo. <laughs> <It's> uh, like, <laughs> so. Cool. I think Kylo wants to see what this guy's going to do. Yeah. Ky Kylo wants to see Aaron smash. <laughs> yeah, smash. Right, let's do it. Let's do it. Everyone cool. has just then said play on. So. In that case, let's do it. So Lovely. So when we're normally like practicing for an event or something, what we would do at this point is go, right, talk it through, mm. re-rack it. Because you yeah. want to try and get as much experience as you can in deployment, yep. in what you do first turn, and yep. also it gives you a really good idea of your averages of what should happen. Exactly. How much of an interaction is first turn in this game? Like, Do you need to then deploy differently? Do you need to put things in strategic reserve? Yep. And it's really good then to get a really good idea of exactly what would happen when you're in that event. So you want to find those consistent and repeatable results. Exactly. Maybe exactly. at the end, you yep. can talk about, obviously, like you do your key moments and mm -hmm. stuff and then go through it all. And yeah, we can do maybe that, yeah. we could do yeah. that at the end. Yeah. I think yeah. that'd be good. So you take the time for that. Yep. Yeah. Sounds excellent. good. All right, then. Cool. Over to your turn right. two, mate. Well, I, uh, I gain one CP, so I'm up to nine again. Yep. Um, now... Because all my knights are Mechanicus, mm -hmm. uh, they've got the Mechanicus Oath, which means that they all get one wound back at oh. the start of the turn. Well, I'll do all these dice then. You, uh, do you do those? <laughs> Just uh, undo your, uh, your lovely work. The Audacity of Aaron. Well, actually, you, he's taken you, four. In fairness, you actually did more damage over here to yourself. Yeah. yeah so um, yeah, you're just exactly. kind of undoing yeah, that. Exactly. So how many CPs have I got left now? I've got one CP left. So I can, tr I can rotate an Iron Shield once. Okay, mate. Cool. So right. Oh, I need to just, goes, can you just uh, palm me into you, obviously, over there? Four. And you get to swing back, by the way. We would forgot to of do course, that. Of course, yeah. Let's, uh, let's do that. So because I'm crashed, I get to re-roll because you have charged me. Yep. So I'm hitting on threes. I'm going to go with the uh, the three damage. Absolutely, one, yep. Because that's the one that does the damage. Uh, okay, cool. So we will re be re-rolling these. This is yep. really nice. You bracketed at this point? Um, I am. Uh, so I would be on a bottom bracket. So yeah. I would be hitting on fives. Okay, so, um, so you'd get to so re-roll one, re one, one, one more of those. Yeah. It which hits. is a hit. Yeah. Threes to wound. No. Okay. I don't know. I'm, okay. I'm okay with that. So start your go, Aaron. What primary score are you getting? Uh, so I will get 10 points for, for being on these. I'm not going to get a whole more. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Cool. Turn two. So, um, Crash Knight's going to kick off, I think, this turn. I got away with last turn yeah. with him, and then the yeah. others showed... The War Dog showed him how it was done, I think. They were like, you might be big, but... Mm. So if I was to go um, 12 inches straight through there, mm -hmm. let's get around the uh, other side of the table. So just a few people have just... They just said they stepped away, or they've just come in, mm -hmm. and they're wondering, obviously, what the conversation was about. Do you want to just quickly go through it again for them? Just say... Yeah, so know. just to quickly... Like, we've got two big knight armies, um, and essentially there were a few key moments in this game in which probably could have gone a little bit better. Um, so what happened was the... Aaron's turn, I would say, was 
fairly predictive. Like you killed a big knight as you should. Um, so I was a knight down going into my first turn. And then I just had a couple of moments where I had to CP reroll a perils. Um, I had to CP reroll a six inch charge, which mm. I failed again. Um, and basically the, the difference is that I went for grind it down, which means I have to kill two things. Now, Aaron killed one and I was only able to kill one small knight. So I lost out on three victory points. Um, and then we had a couple of other moments with me, my big dragon knight with the two yeah. thermals. You made all your saves. I only got three shots on my 2d6 weapon. So there was just a couple of like... In and then I failed to kill you in combat, which is the other big one. Yeah. After investing all the CPs for the re-rolls, yeah, just a bit of a whiffer, really. So, and that's yeah. how it goes sometimes yeah. when you play an army like knights. They are so, each roll is so significant mm -hmm. because each roll can be representative of, you know, maybe 300 points. Mm -hmm. And those key rolls can, re they can like go really well. Yeah. Like if you make all your saves, they're bloody brilliant. But if you whiff a little bit, then it can also hit you hard as well. So, yeah, it's yeah. why I personally would never take knights to a tournament. <laughs> yeah. Because it would just infuriate me. No, yeah. Um, yeah, there are there are armies like that that, that get you. For me, it's, it's Harlequins. Um, yeah. I, uh, <laughs> I think that as well, what you've really got to consider is that I got first turn and I killed a knight in a turn, which is obviously, we what, do preach yeah. that you need to be able to kill a knight in a turn. Yeah. Um, but that means that it's now a 2,000 point versus what? Just 1,500 point lit, like yeah. game. So yeah. it's, a, it's a really sort yeah. of uphill battle to, to be able to then achieve what you want to achieve in that. Absolutely, time. yeah. I was hoping to, I was, my, I was expecting to kill this knight here in shooting yep. and then kill the two smaller ones in combat. Yeah. yeah. And that was kind of what I was aiming for, or at least killing one and making you spend some CPs to interrupt. Because yep. I was going to fight first over here, because he was already taking some damage, this one. Because um, I, I wanted to soften him up enough to basically shoot him off the table charge, that one. Yep. Kill him to get me my two points on the grind, and then injure him enough. I wouldn't need to necessarily stress about it, but hopefully bracket this guy. Yep. Make you spend those CPs to go up onto full bracket, and then take him out in my next turn. But yep. because he's still completely fine, You've still got your CPs. Exactly. We're also playing, how many CPs have you got? Uh, I've got nine now. And I've got one. Yeah. So with, I'm also out of my resources as well. Yeah. So that's where these things are just so impactful when it comes to the table. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. All yeah. right. Let's do it. Cool. Right. I'm going to start moving some around there. Mm -hmm. um, I will come around this I side. got one off for my psychic ritual, by the way. So I need to do that two more times. So I'm going to get this guy uh, just moving mm -hmm. along. So he's going to go... Go 10 to there, and then another four. That way, along, around the building. Along yeah. to there. Um, again, getting that engaged. Now, obviously, we do need to make sure that we're going to take this, uh, this objective uh, back, obviously, and, and really layer up on it as well. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm going to just shift this guy here. Stay outside of an inch. Outside of an inch. Um, this one's also going to come up. Um, we're going to shift this guy forward just so we get in that uh, plus one. Now I need to designate which unit designate you put which that unit on. It's on. Unit it's on, so it's going to be on this this uh, this big knight in the middle. Okay. Oh, you nominate one of my knights, not one of your units. Okay, so it's one of my knights. All right. Yeah, exactly. uh, so that's why that would have missed against the one. Yes. Okay, so if you pick a knight within twenty-four, so you pick a knight within twenty-four, and then everything within six of him. Oh, so you have to be within twenty-four as well. Yeah. Okay. You don't need to have line of sight. You just need to be within 24. Okay. So. Okay. All right. It's just a, f a few people came up with in the chat. So yeah, no, that's good. Yeah. yeah. So thanks for that chat. That's good. Okay. Handy um, dandy app. <laughs> this guy is going to stay in combat because mm -hmm. uh, I just don't want to take the overwatch from, from this, basically. Fair enough, yeah. Uh, so I've got a six-inch charge coming from this one into here. Okay. Um, so I've got this one is still in, in engagement, right? Uh, Engagement range, yeah. Engagement range and but engagement it's blast weapon, fans. isn't it? So you can't fire the um, the thermal lances blast. Can't fire the thermal, but I can fire the melter gun. Oh, very nice. Yeah, yeah. So not, not what we want. <laughs> right. Um, You're just looking at me like I don't know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> To confirm, um, it is warm in here for everyone. Steve's not just sweating because he's warm. lost a few nights. It is very warm. <laughs> I mean, I'm sweating. It is a beautiful day. I can't believe I lost my corn guy. 
can't even hear a clean Tavine anymore. You were so excited about it. I him. know. I yeah. wanted to turn off your invuns. I wanted to kill a knight in combat. Tell you what, but I no. am going to... Uh, you ruin all my... F- you're, Aaron, you're not coming on again. You ruin all my fun. <laughs> do, you want, do you want Joe back? Yeah, get Joe. No, actually, no. <laughs> Me and Jake, we'll, we'll have a nice game. We'll have a, we'll good, have a nice We game. always have a good game. Uh, we do, mate. Do you want to that in or not? I'm sick of playing Drakari. Ugh. Yeah, I bet. And I, I'm not a very big fan of 90s Eldar either, but there we go. Yeah. <laughs> okay. yeah, you've played it once, all right? Yeah. Try a week. Try a whole week, Jake, yeah. of um, Drakari. We should have a throwback week where we just play like really like <laughs> retro armies. Retro, yeah. You say you've got one CP? Yes, mate. Okay, so I'm going to go on out of limb and think that you're going to go for a, a rotate, ion, rotate shield. ion shield. Probably, mate, yeah. So I'm not going to worry about the... Uh, the Overwatch, I think that's a pretty minimal thing, really, especially yeah. considering what happened last time. Yeah, I think you're okay. Um, so this guy's remember gonna... you can rotate Iron Shield as well, even in Overwatch, and you've got the CP to spare. Yeah, because it's only when you're targeted. So, um, yeah. so he's just going to come back because I've realised I haven't got anything in this quarter now cool. to uh, to give me that engage. So I want to make sure I'm there. Mm-hmm. Now, uh, end of the uh, end of the movement phase, I'm going to use one of my Scions squads. I've got to just figure out which one I want to do. Um, I am going to deep strike. That corner, isn't it? Well, that's a little bit too close. What I'm going to do is just deep strike within five inches. Now, I'm just going to double check that there. And you can do that uh, with a stratagem, correct? Exactly. For one CP, I can deep strike within five inches. I just want to see if I can actually achieve anything with that. Uh, yes, yeah, so basically, and it's going to be really difficult for you guys to see. Okay. Um, but just under here. So we'll move this out of the way. Yeah. Cool. So just under here, I can just nip onto this little corner here. Deep strike in within five inches. Yep, and then also I can be take outside that, of five from him as well. Be outside of five from him. Just yep. get one guy on the objective for objective secured. Cool. And then uh, scramble. String, scramble back, string back a little bit and scram, scramble your deep line. But, um, and that was roughly there, wasn't Your it? back line, but also cool. taking away that... Um, I mean, also, what you could technically do is just put a model up on the terrain there. Yeah, yeah. You can do yeah, that. Yeah, actually, yeah. You can just do that, yeah. yeah put that it up would, there, uh, um, and you can scramble. Yeah. Cool. So and then I, are, I can't uh, even charge you, so I, can, I have to shoot them off. Okay, yeah. Yeah. It's providing that you stay an inch away from the edge, then I'm going to struggle to charge you, yeah. Yeah. Because so the engagement range is an inch, and then also five high. Five, so five high, so yeah. As long as you I'm stay, not going yeah. to struggle to... And remember, I need to get there. my psychic action, so I can't leave this guy out yeah. of the centre anyway. So, yeah. yeah. Very so, nice. Um, yeah, I mean, this... this I use this all the time with these scions. They're in my main uh, main list, and it's, it's a really nice piece of tech. Yep. It looks quite funny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, cool. Nice. So, just for the people at home as well, how do you get that stratagem? Is that the special? That is. Uh, that's with the I- Ioten Gorgons. Yep. Um, it's a one CP stratagem specifically for that that Tempestus regiment. Okay. Um, obviously, this they deep strike for free, mm-hmm. um, and you can do that. Every turn, mm-hmm. so uh, yeah, it's, it's it's a really good piece. Um, you're paying forty points for the Tempest or Prime. You're paying forty-five points for uh, each unit of, of uh, Scions, and you've got free scrambles. It's and incredible, it's yeah. Giving you engage, it's it's, it's amazing. Oh, it's really good. good isn't it? Yeah, it is awesome. Really good. Cool. All right. Um, it's do a I want nice to put down to the list, isn't it? Because you don't yeah, lose exactly. anything either way. Exactly. So, yeah. It's all gain, um, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. And what I will also do, actually, is just to just to put this guy down on here. I haven't got anyone on this objective, and this guy's not going to do much for me cool. for the rest of the game anyway. And um, it means so I have just to shoot him. The... And I've only got one gun that can fire directly, so... Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Why not? Um, tuck him nice, nicely in, so we're not going to get very good angles. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's, uh, that's... I'll keep this other unit up in the air for next turn, obviously. Yep. Um, that is the end of my movement phase. Okay, shooting phase. What are you kicking off first? Shooting phase, right. So, I think the uh, majority of damage I want to try and get onto this guy. I know you can get him back up once, but you're going to have to get him back up again. It's on a 50-50, so... Exactly, yeah. exactly. And so, it's end of the phase. End of the phase. So, uh, yeah, we will start with uh, with this guy. Yep. 
he's going to fire, fire everything into that. Okay. Um, so he does also have, he should be in range, I think it's 12 inches for the... Uh, so obviously I'm going to rotate Iron Shield. You will, yeah. 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 I'm uh, just going to double check in the book, mm -hmm. just to... Uh, Shock horror. <laughs> <laughs> Can't actually find where they are. Is there any uh, chats to go through while I look at this? Lots of afternoons. Everybody's just joining. We've got a few of the academy students. Yeah. Yeah. Just, yeah. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I've got a few of the academy students. Someone said that they've stumbled across us when they've searched 40k Questor Imperialis Law Ooh. into YouTube. Ooh. And we do like to be very narrative here. We, we are a very narrative channel. Yeah. yeah. Jerry's yeah. here in the back room shouting immersion and, <laughs> and foaming at the mouth. D don't encourage him. Hey. Don't encourage him. Just right. shout things. <laughs> <laughs> he looks quite tame, to be fair. <laughs> yeah, he's content. Yeah. Cool. Right, so uh, obviously we have got the lightning cannon that we've had earlier. Yeah. And the, the rapid fire in uh, phase plasma fusel. Then on top of that, we've got a twin rad cleanser, which is strength 2d6. And I will be... Sorry, it's assault 2d6. And I will be wounding you on sixes because you're a vehicle slash Titanic. Mm -hmm. But it's flat three damage, um, zero AP. Yeah. Um, auto hitting. Um, so that would that be. Keep that page open. You should need, oh. That's a good shout. I, I do I'll remember the number. And then you get plus two damage as well, right? Plus two damage, exactly. So, so it's, 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 it's five windows. damage. Exactly, exactly. Okay. So we will start off with that. Yep. Um, so two d six shots. So also I'm going to spend my CP to rotate iron shields. Yeah. Cool. I had already done it. Cool. Two d six also hitting. Nine. Strong. Nine. Four. Six, strong. Yep. Seven. Eight. Nine. So these will be wounded on sixes, okay. but against anything else, it's, uh, it's got two, that's quite nice, but it's zero AP. Um, but any fail will be flat five damage. Well, they both failed. And you failed both of them, wow. <laughs> so it's 10 damage, cool. What, what are they called? Uh, that's the twin rad cleanser. No, no, the, the name of the model. Uh, this is the Questorus Knight Megera. Right, now it's just followed out on Forge World. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. Two, four, six, eight. It's a good, it's a good one. Yeah, and I don't have CPs to be re-roll it either. No. So, uh, yeah, he's in trouble. This is the eight shots. Yep. So we have got, and uh, we are re-rolling the ones. Yep, because the first night... Oh, strong. That's <laughs> so strong. Yeah, that's good, mate. Two, three. Get them three sixes. Four, five, six. Five to wounds. I don't wound. think I've got enough, enough uh, dice there. Do you want some more, three, mate? please? Oh, yeah, sure. Here you go, mate. Happy to give you them. Thank you very much. Happy to give you those. Aaron has come uh, here. I don't know why I was rolling that. You, they you are don't just, need to they roll are just hits. You, you just wanted to show off that you could yeah. hit all of them as well. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. Right, so these are wounded on fives. Aaron has come here to... To, to to bring his lovely knights, proceed to roll as obnoxiously as Joe, <laughs> and then leave. <laughs> I mean, I think I think you might be more obnoxious than Joe. I hate to say it. Joe, <laughs> um, so I failed one, two, three. So Slightly better uh, for me that time. Fifteen damage. Okay, so I've got one wound left. One wound left. Yep. Um, and then uh, we have got the rapid firing gun. Sure. One. Oh, you we missed there. One. You okay? You've just missed. I missed once. <laughs> you I did. missed. I'm really sorry. I'm sorry, guys. So there's fives, yeah? Fives to win. Oh, no, no wins. Oh, no wins. I'm not winning. Not winning. Okay, then. What's next, mate? Cool. What is next? Straight right. to the strawberry basket there. Yeah. Okay. Wow. Well, um, we will start with... He did with 25 damage. To... Just himself. Just himself. To, to a rotated iron shield knight. Yeah. Unbelievable, wow. Jeff. Unbelievable. <laughs> yeah. Unbelievable. Oh, yeah. Ooh, spicy. Yeah. Go on, wow. then. Right, next? okay, so we're going to just uh, chuck this one into sure. him. So that will be D3, D3 shots. Yep. Three shots. Mm hmm. Two hits. Two, uh, you get plus one to hit, remember? Plus one to hit. You do, yep. Thank you very much. I no think problem. I think Aaron is taking his anger out after Met Ben move block most of his orcs. Yeah. <laughs> like revenge. Yeah. <laughs> Three wounds. He's dead. Does he explode? He doesn't, luckily. Yeah. If he'd exploded, I would not be getting back up. So I'm ah. just, so oh. just going to take him off the table. 
but we know that his position was literally right here. So I'm going to leave that dice there as a marker, okay? Mm. All right, then, what's next? Right. This so, one fell back, so he can't shoot. So you've just got these, this guy and these three, four left. Four left. Uh, yeah, one, two, three, plus him. Okay. Um, so we will go with... Let's try and take you off this objective here. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to do this one here. That was the no, one that just shot. No, he shot yeah. this one here into there. Okay. And you should, from my eyes, be within four, uh, oh, it's 12 inches, isn't it? I think, yeah, he is. He is right. You're within 12, yeah, and also cool. you're within 15 to get your double damage, yeah. Cool. So, um, yeah, so we'll do the uh, melter first. Yep. Here's a hit. Two shots, that is. Oh, the melter gun first, yep. you said, yep. Wounds. Wounds. Five plus. Cool. He's, okay. He's okay. D3 shots. That's three. Three. Twos. Uh, your threes, because that was the one you're not, you're hitting on threes, aren't you? Because it was, you nominated my big boy to get the plus yeah, one. Sorry, sorry, yeah, sorry, sorry, yeah. So, but they do hit. Yeah. Um, one wound. One wound, five plus. He's so, oh, I can save this guy. It's not, it's not going to help me. <laughs> uh, yeah. Right, um, so we'll do this one. Yep. Him. Um, so D3 and the melter. Yep. So melter. Hits on a three. Yep. Wounds on a three. Yep. Gone through. Cool. So D6 plus two on this one because he's within six. Yep. Uh, five damage. Okay. Um, then we've got that one's shot. So these two have shot. So we've got that one over there. Yep. Um, melter and D3. Um, That's the melter gun, yeah. Yeah. So hits. You didn't wounds. do this. You didn't do the lance with that guy. So you, you need to go back and do that. Do that, yeah. Uh, so that's safe. We need to do the, the actual yep. blast lance with that one. D3. Three shots. Yep. Uh, three hits. Yep. One wound. One wound. Goes through. Three, six, quick highest. Three. Take an eight. So I've got five left. Cool. And then did I finish that one? You did, yeah. Cool. So we do this one over here. Yep. Um, same, same again. Yep. So we'll do the melter first. Mm -hmm. Is a hit. No wound. And the D3. One, no. And the big boy? Big boy. Um, he's going to do his, so where do we want to go? I can't interrupt. Yeah. He'll do, he'll do the big gun into this Moirax here. Yep. He'll do, I think he's probably out of 12, maybe, maybe not. He's in. He's in. 2d6 and the rapid fire into that one. Okay. So we'll do the, uh, the 2d6. Um, yep. First, four shots. Is that four automatic hits, isn't it? Yep. Yep. Wounded on sixes. Nothing. Okay. We've got what the rapid fire. earlier? <laughs> I know. Rapid fire. Uh, no rerolls there, and a four. Yep. One wound. Goes through. Cool. Damage is double check. That's fuck damage two, I believe. Yeah. Damage cool. two. One wound left. Cool. Um, and we've got the eight shots coming in. Two, four, six, eight. Onto this guy. Mm-hmm. That oh, was this guy. Yeah, the armature there. Yeah. Cool. Uh, they will miss. No exploding this time. Nope. And these are wounded on fours. There we go. There we go. Were you strengths? Oh, yeah. You're strength on the armor, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's right, yeah. Okay, charge phase. Right. So, the, I can't uh, overwatch. I can't interrupt. Can't overwatch. Can't You're interrupt. Free to do what so you want. This guy, we've got the six inch charge into this one. Yeah, this is when you kind of want to make it. I really want to make this one. Yeah. Not on that. Not on that. You'll CP reroll that one. CP reroll that. Yeah. Kind of hoping you fail it. <sighs> Just so I've got a chance. He's failed, failed it. Failed it. Oh. Maybe I've got a chance. If my knight can stand back up, maybe I can do it. <laughs> wow. For the corn god. He's, he's, he's coming back for me. I mean, I'm this is going to die. But I'm yeah. shell shocked. Charges cool. over here. Right. Um, Gosh, this has now got exciting. It has, doesn't it? Wow, that is very exciting. Right, I'm going to charge this unfailable okay. into here. Do you want to just me push him in? Yeah, sure. You can't really go anywhere else. 
I'm now going to pay one CP yep. to do a stratagem that allows me to, within 12 inches, re-roll failed charges on armages. Oh, very nice. Okay. Yep. I don't want to fail <laughs> anymore. Yep. So I'm going to do this one. Yep. Into that last guy there. Carry on. Yep. So just to clarify, you're going to need a. You're within six. Cool. So I think well, I think you're well within six. You're actually within five, so you need a four. I need a four. You're in. You rolled an 11. I rolled an 11. So let's go over here. Yeah, you charge him with this guy? Because you yeah. don't want to block yourself if I'm you I'm going to charge. He can go straight. Uh, straight in the smaller straight charge. Yeah, cool. And you are within 12. Yep. So you are going to get your rerolls. Four. You are within five, so you're in. Cool. I'll move this bit of pipe. Okay. Beautiful. Right. So no interrupts. Um, so we will just start off with, uh, we'll start off with this one. Yep. So uh, hit on threes. Do you, to, do you want to roll them both together? Yeah, I may as well. I can re-roll everything. Yep. Uh, hit, so we're using the, uh, the three damage one, hitting on threes. Uh, Rerolling failed hits because of crest. Yep. Take that one out. And then wounding on threes. Yep. All wounds. There wound. you go. All wounds. How many so is that? Four, five, six, seven. Two, five, seven. Minus three. Okay. He is dead. Yep, because he'd already taken three wounds earlier, so that's 15. Otherwise, he would have been alive with a wound Ooh, left. Yeah. Does he explode? Come on, baby. Come on, come on, come on. No. Cool. That's a shame. Um, and the last guy over there. Cool. Uh, I'm just going to do a little bit of the pile in there. Okay. Just to... Screen me off. Screen you off from the... Uh, and this one just piles Four attacks there. on that one. He's got one left. Yep. Hitting on uh, threes. All hit. Mm -hmm. Wounding on threes. Uh, it's three wounds, minus three. Does he explode? He does. He does. He does. D3 damage to you. Two. Two. Uh, so that he's now taken four. Uh, that one was around the edge, so he won't have this any. This one's fine. So this, this yeah, one will right. take three. This one will take two. So that one goes up to taking three now. Yep. Okay, and, he's and that taken, one there needs a, needs a dice. Taking three as well. And I think three. I'm within three, uh, six even, probably. Uh, I assume so. I take two. Cool. Yeah. Oh, and then the most important thing is the... You couldn't have declared this guy's a charge, you know, could you? Does that cost a... Uh, come out? No, it's a warlord trait. It's a warlord it? trait. So it's on a four plus. Come on. <laughs> Just roll a six. Roll a six. Just roll a six to be sure. It's a five. He's, He's gone back up. up. His once per game ability. He's back in action. He is awake now. With D three wounds left. Come on, big six, big six, big six. Oh, with wow. one wound left. Great. Well, at least he's left. up. He is up. There's something. <sighs> right. He's good. <sighs> He's dead. So you've killed two knights this turn. My turn. I am on zero objectives. It's always fun. Yeah, that scion little thing there. Yeah. Saved you five. Yeah. Or stopped me from getting five. So on to my movement phase. Okay. So I'll get three for engage at the end of that one. So I've got this little chappy down here. And how many will you get when you bring it down? Um, um, Kill two art, uh, two, four two war dogs, four. and uh, one big one. No, the, not yeah. the big one. Oh yeah, four points. Four so. points. Yep. Okay. Well, if I go there, I can contest that. So that that'll be quite nice. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to go well in the middle of it, so you can't do that five-inch trick again. <laughs> um, he's going to die next turn. There's nothing I can do about that. Um, Hmm. Need to kill this thing. Need to kill that thing. Need to take him off that objective. I don't really have anything. He's got how many wounds left? Four. Four. Le uh, yeah, four left. He's going to move into that building there. Cool. Jump on that objective. Yeah. Um. And then he can just chill there. I think. 
So is it your intention to be able to fight through that? Uh, no. I'm going to shoot him. Uh, yeah, there's no I'm going to shoot there's him. There's no chance I can do it. Shoot him, charge him. Cool. You've got a three hinge row convention, but yeah, yeah, I'm not going to reach three. there. Okay. Cool. Do keep outside of fives, you can't do that thing again. Um, this guy is just going to have to pretty much chill there, I think, because I've got to do my psychic action, otherwise I... Because I can't even afford you to overwatch. Because mm. if you overwatch, then I'm dead. Because the thing is, as well, the is, we is left. these are exploding sixes times two. So and you've got the flamer, so you all take it. Yeah. I can't afford to... Well, he's, the thing is, he's dead anyway. Um, you're just going to interrupt and pick him up. So... Unless I fight first with him. But I've only got one CP, so I don't have enough CPs to reroll misses. Oh, this has not gone well. I'm only moving six inches as well. So it doesn't really give me a huge amount here to play with. Um, I'm just going to stay within six inch there. Give me some options, I think. Okay. Can Do you have a stratagem that can allow you to shoot on full bracket? No. no. Okay. Unfortunately not. The Chaos Knights not get that. No. No. Um, so, Psychic Phase goes off. Goes off. Um, then we're going to go for the Shooting Phase. Uh, this one here, this armager, is going to shoot this one here. Okay? Cool. 2d3 shots. Oh, actually, no. We're going to put this big boy into here. It's here. Okay, so I will um, rotate. rotate on that one. Okay, cool. 2d6 shots. Five. I was, I was hoping like for a 9-10 after the... Yeah. Just, just for those to average out a little bit. Four hits. Uh, three wounds. Have I got one CP left? Screw it. I'll re-roll that one. No, I might need it for a reroll charge. Three saves. Three saves. Three four ups. Four ups. He's passed them all. Okay. Um, next up, the That's three fair. shots from the um, w ones hit from the rocket. Failed to wound. Okay, it's not gone well. <laughs> okay. Uh, strength eight. So wounds on fours. Oh dear. Cool. Um, yeah, it's not gone well. Not like this. Right, so... I don't have enough shots to kill him, so it's pointless shooting him. I haven't touched him, so there's literally no point even firing at him anymore. Um, hopefully kill him in combat. And then it's just what damage I can do over here, really. So I'm going to go first of all with this guy here. It's going to put everything into this guy. Cool. No, actually, we'll go that knight over there. Yeah. That yeah. armager into this one that you can see. Okay. Because he's okay. lost three wounds. Cool. Yeah. Um, Forty-three shots. And you may as well put his heavy stubber into into that faff, yeah. into them boys. All right. Cool. So three hits. Uh, no, that's my shots, isn't it? So that's the two, that's the four, and then that's another two. Okay, hitting on threes, wounding on fours. Three saves, mate. Three saves. Minus one. On a four. Uh, no, that is going to be him dead. Nine damage. Um, Does it explode? I think I'm inclined to CP roll one of those. Okay. You've got that. To shoot still. Yes, and this one as well. And this one as well. Oh no, I'll, I'll save that. Does he, do you explode, mate? Does he explode? That was this one here, yeah? Yeah. Cool. And then the three stubbers at your boys up there. Uh, all hit. One wound on the stubbers. One wound on the stubbers. Okay. The you get. Uh, so I'm in cover, so four up into three up. Yep. No, nope, one dead. Okay. So. Um, next up, we'll go for this armager here. We'll go, go on this one here. Cool. Uh, 43 shots, isn't it? Uh, 
Then on threes. And then heavy stubbers again going on to those boys. So, uh, only four hits. Fives. Uh, fours even. So three saves. Three saves. Four ups. Um, Pass them, them all. This guy put the absolutely everything into him. Mm -hmm. uh, the Top Gun D6 shots. One shot. One hit. Uh, no, I'll be hitting on fives now because I've only got one wound left. Yeah. So that misses. Um, his, he's got a heavy flamer. Is that in range of... No, it's going to be out. Um, so onto him. Should be in range of that. Yeah. So heavy flamer. Five hits. At least I can hit with that thing. <laughs> Fives. One save. Cool. Minus, Minus one. one. Uh, no. Takes a wound. So yep. he's uh, taken four. Yeah. That's right, mate. I, knew, I normally personally count down. So. That's all right. That's fine. Uh, that was a bit better rolling from me there. Ooh, nice. Five to wound though. Uh, only two saves. Two saves. And these are D3 damage each, right? Yeah. A uh, flat two. Flat two. Yeah. Okay. So it just takes two. So he's okay. uh, he's taken six. Okay. Cool. All right. Um, that's good. So that's ever that's all my shooting uh, charges. He is going to charge onto. Um, he's taken six now, isn't he? I'm going yes. to charge onto here. Okay, would that um, would that break your psychic spell? Your psychic. I don't think so, but we. The psychic action is just as long as you done it. You done, done it. Done psychic it. Phase, to be yeah. honest, you're going to kill him. He's only got a wound. Yeah, there. no, no. Um, so this guy here will charge first. By the way, into there. Cool. Yeah. Five. He's just going to pivot a little bit to cool. stay on the objective and get within an inch of you. Yeah. This one I will overwatch for one CP. This guy here is going to charge in on here. Cool. It's 11, because I can get to the edge of that building there and, and get within an range. inch. Cool. Um, this one here is not going to... He's not a character. He can't in, in here... No, the around. only character is... And he, this yeah, one. Yeah. Is that sort of three. Okay, so this one here will declare on this knight here. Cool. Uh, so I will overwatch. So oh, I'll no. do the uh, Melticon first. No, and then D3 shots. One on a six. No way. I can't believe it. <laughs> right, on a four. On a four. Oh, it's a no. two. So I see you. I see you re roll. He's CP re roll and he's going for I it. I think that, that would be the thing to do. Mm, it, it would be the thing to do. No. Okay. There you go. Charges in. Cool. 11. Okay, so I'm going to go first with this guy here. Cool. Unfortunately, I don't have any CPs to re-roll. Um, not, not enough to get my re-rolls I need, yes, because it's two. Do I go for six shots? Because if I get one through, probably best doing it. So five, sh five attacks even. With the Reaper Chainsword? Yeah, it's probably better, because I yeah. just need one to I'm go on, through. Exactly, I'm on six, yeah. yeah. I've hit three times. I'll take that. Wounding three times, so he'll be dead at minus four. Minus four, yep. yeah. Cool, does he blow up? Please don't, <laughs> please don't. Tell you what I'm gonna do. What's that? <laughs> I'm gonna pay two CP. Okay. To blow up on a four. Okay, so you need to roll a one, two or three, please. It's a four. It's a four. Okay, cool. So, uh, well I'm dead. You're dead. Do I explode? How many CPs is it for me to explode? <laughs> I think yours is also two, but just quickly it's double fine. check. It's fine, I'm just going to roll a six. Yeah, He's done it, wow. Right, so. Wow. More of that, actually. How big is that? Right. That's huge. Well, so, do you want to do yours first? Yeah. <laughs> you, is your explosion a bigger range because of it, or is that just, is that the Imperial, is that the big knight one? Just, yeah, that's just the big knight. Oh. So, so yours just, is, well, he's going to get catch him. Yeah. And so you're on this guy over here first. This guy over here, yeah. D, D3, is one. Well, you're going to get that back anyway, so it's pointless. Yeah, no, we won't take that off. Uh, this one, one. Okay, so there's no point changing that either, yeah. So, yeah. Just add on what I exactly. do. Exactly. Uh, this one? Yeah. Two. Uh, uh, probably out of six, though, actually. Let's have a look. Yeah, he's out. Out of six. Cool. So he's fine as well. So, so this is my damage now. And mine's D6. So I roll two dice first of all, don't know how to see the distance. Yeah. Right, come on. Six, six inches. That's quite good, because that won't get me in. Hopefully. 
Oh no, it's got me in. Um, and then <laughs> just you. So on me, D6, six obviously. <laughs> Brilliant. That's, that's good fun. On you, come on, big six. Just the one on you then, cool. Um, what is this game? On me, on this big knight here, uh, in the pocket, five oh, on him. Nice. He's up to six there. And that's it. So we take me off, and we take you off. Okay. Right, what a crazy game. That was bonkers, I think. Yeah. Um, you interrupting? Um, We're not bothering. I... I need one CP next turn to do something fun. You're not, uh, you're not going to kill me, are you? So. You do have one CP. so that's I am going to... I've got one left, have I? Okay. What, are you hitting on fives? Um, you're hitting on fives because you've got four wounds left. I can't, I've only got one CP, so I can't. Oh, okay. Yeah, I've uh, been miscounting. Um, so, well, I'll go over with this guy then, into your boys. Five hits... Two's to wound, and you've only got one wound. Oh, oh no. Got a command point. I need to kill him because got you've got obsec. Um, a minus one. No, I don't get minus one because it's not a melee weapon, so you're just on your armor save. Because it's not a specific melee weapon, so it's no point, so you can roll three armor saves. Yeah. Yeah, on your boys over there. Four up saves. Yeah. You'd love it. You only lost one. Cool. Mm. Right. So, uh, over here then, my 15 attacks goes on to your other knight. Uh, leaving the uh, prime. Uh, they miss. And then... Wounding on threes. So, two, four, six, eight saves at minus. Three. That's two, I think. Oh, no, you've got plus one for, um, I think, the, the Chaos minus, Knights get an extra. Yeah, point. it's minus three because of my Iconoclast, yeah. yeah. Um, so you've got many, two, four, six, eight. Four, well, he's got... I think he's dead. Yeah. Um, failed four. And failed one. Yeah, yeah, failed seven. He's dead. He's dead. So does it... Oh, you need to roll if he explodes. Yeah, does it explode? Hope, hopefully not. No, he's gone. Okay. Right, so, end of that. Um, you killed... Three knights that turn, because you killed two babies in one big one. Yep. yep. And I only killed three knights, so I don't get grind them down. Um, and so no, none of that. I'm not going to get my psychic ritual. Um, so at the start of your turn, you're holding uh, one, two, three. So you're going to get 15 points there. Yeah. And all, all these guys heal a wound back, but we've already done that anyway, haven't we? Yeah. So. Yeah. So these ones, this one will. Uh Go down to, to three taken. Okay. Um, yeah, I think. So I will gain a CP mm -hmm. up to two. So I want to I see what this guy can do in melee. I think that's, uh, that's going to be a bit of fun. So can I fight through? Because you're touching this. Can I fight through this here? Sure. Cool. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so yeah, I'm just going to come around and make it basically an unfailable charge. Yeah, no worries. You have fun. You do that. You do that. You do that. You do that. Steve's just vibing now. He's just like, yeah, what's going <laughs> on, guys? Mm. Oh, and um, do you need a morale on the scions? No, yes. they only lost two. They lost two. They only lost two. Got uh, leadership seven. Oh, maybe do that. Oh, so on a six, you'll fail. That's a five, he's okay. He's, he's, he's all, all good. A brave little guardsman. Mm. Indeed, indeed. Uh, so these are just going to fall back. Yep. And stay over the top of uh, yep. of that, but outside an inch of yourself. Cool. So they're on that objective. Um, he's going into there. <laughs> I'm sorry. You don't have to apologise, mate. Yeah. You just won't be welcome back again. <laughs> dice like yours, all right? I, Which were my dice. Hey, they're your dice, yeah. I, I only get to come back because I do what I say, yeah. rather than what Steve says. <laughs> because he rolls average. He, he, goes, back. he goes, now don't roll too many sixes, otherwise you know what happens. You know what happens. <laughs> You're walking home. Yeah. <laughs> so we're saying we can, we can go through there. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
So you oh. need unfailable charge there. You he shifting him forward onto that objective? Yeah, he's going forward. Yep. Um, I've Lovely. got from there. So I've got in this quarter, in that quarter, in that quarter, and in that quarter. Yep. Um, Does he want to get line of sight anywhere to that he's one? He's going to be able to see that. He can oh, see, he see the big boy. There. Yeah, of course you can. Um, let's just move him so he's got line of sight. Give you options. Through onto that, exactly. Yeah. Um, double check my range. Yep, 30. Cool. Nicely in. And you're going to pick which knight to get plus one to hit on. Yeah, it's so it's got to be within 24. So um, I reckon we will go for... The Helverin? Well, it's only this guy that's going to be able to do it. Um, so we will... Well, or this guy. Well, have you got to it's be within, within six. six. Oh, within oh. six of him. And 24 of him. Are cool. Yeah, yeah makes sense. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Exactly. Um, so we will just pick, um, I'll pick this one. Cool. Because I've already taken six wounds on that guy yeah. after my lovely explosion. Yeah, that exactly. Ended up hurting me more than you. Yes, <laughs> yes, yes. Yes. Can't just the that. way the cookie grumbles. <laughs> yes. Um, so I've lost three guys there. Oh, there's one off the table there. Cool. Take your wounds with you. No, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I've did all these three, precious... Three no, weeks. don't take these wounds away from me, Aaron, OK? <laughs> I've worked hard to do yeah. this. Yeah. yeah. It's my hard graft. Um, he's on there. And then we've got the uh, the old Scions to come in. Now, I don't think it's going to... Stick him here, mate. Bang a scrambler down. And get exactly. I don't need to do anything else. Um, so we'll put the... Don't need to overthink it, mate, at this stage. Three, four, five. Just about clean up now. Yeah, it's just... Go maid style. Yeah, clean up. <laughs> Yeah, you can do this blindfolded, Aaron. I think at this point it's a really good sort of example of obviously when you've had that game like that, making sure that you're tying up those loose ends. You've got to score as much as you can, yeah. basically. Yeah, yeah. yeah make sure it doesn't. That's all the mistakes. As soon mm. as that scrambles down, there's not really any mistakes you can make from no, this point. No. So it's just apart kill. from getting your engaged in all fronts and stuff, which you're easily going to get every turn. Exactly. Cool. Cool. Right. Um, so what I'm going to do is. Uh, this guy, yep. Rad Cleanser into there. Okay. Uh, obviously, we have scrambled over there. Rad yep. Cleanser into there. Um, rapid Fire into there, and the Lightning Cannon into that one. Okay. So we'll do the Lightning Cannon first. Eight shots. Do you mind if I have another dice, please? How many? One more, please. Thank you. Eight shots, and this is the Lightning into, uh, into this chapel here. Okay. Uh, we've got one six, so we'll just keep the one and the two. Oh, no, I'll re roll the one. Yep. Okay, two sixes. There you go, I'll put them in for you. That's two there. Two there. And, and two then. there. And then take that take two that out. one out. Yep. And this will be wounded on fours. Yep. And you plus one damage. Yeah, so take those out. Yep. And uh, that many. This is, uh, yeah, plus one damage. So four, four Do I have a CP left? Do, don't I? Cool. Uh, two have saved. And then each of these are how many uh, damage four each? each? Four each. Okay, yep. so does it explode? Uh, no, he doesn't. Cool. All right. <laughs> I'm going to spend my CP to rotate him, obviously. Cool. So we've got the 2d6 uh, auto-hitting. Yeah. Uh, four shots. Mm -hmm. Is that the only guns you can put on him, by the way? Because this is only this is any minus, is it, on this weapon? Uh, there's no minus on that, but I've also got this gu this big gun over here. Yeah, I mean, I'm not going to bother rotating. So carry no, don't no. Yeah. Okay, so four shots, hit on, uh, wounded on sixes, auto-hitting. Uh, one. Armour save. It's okay. Oh, that's it. And the rapid fire. Um, all hit. Yep. Four fives. Uh, three. Minus. Minus two. Failed them all. So that'll be... Five damage each? Yeah. Okay, so it's 15 gone through. So it's, my, it's two damage flat. Was that no, on it's, that four, guy? it's four damage. That's on him? Yeah. Yeah, there's the rapid fire. It's four damage each. Okay. Um, so, so 12, 12, 12. taken. 12 taken, he's got 14 left. Cool. Um, this guy will do everything into that one. Okay. So, five, can I have another three, please? Yep. Just your rapid fire thing. Yeah, this cool. is the, this is the, um, the lightning. Cool. Okay, so take those out, add another two for that, and another two for those, another two for those. Winding on fours. Yep. These guns are mental. I've, this is the first time I've played the Magara. I'm not and letting you borrow these again. No. I think it was... Ooh, wow. What is that, Aaron? Look at that. What is that? Oh, God. Strength seven, yeah? Strength seven. Force. Look at that. 
Okay, cool. So, um, and they're flat three um, each? Flat three, right, right. So, so, yeah, I mean, he's dead. Does, does he explode? No. He's gone. Cool. Right, I think um, the only thing for it really is I'm going to charge, charge this guy into thermal here. Thermal in there first? Uh, no, I didn't put anything in. Th that was, uh, oh, this guy? Yeah. You've got your thermal. You've made thermal, yeah, 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 yeah. These yeah. three shots. Yep. Uh, two. Yep. Let's have a couple of those. Um, one hit. One hit. Fours. No. Okay. How many attacks do you get? Four attacks. Okay. Uh, I can't one even. Hit. Is it worth me spending my last CP in Overwatching? Sure. Oh, yeah. Uh, always. You go on, Steve. Sure. Can I set go to on. defend? <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting three shots with my big double cannon. It's good. Unbelievable. There yeah. it is. Another three. Oh. And I've hit once. Oh. Wounded once. Oh. Wounded once. Yeah, five up. Oh, oh, D oh, two D6 damage. Pick the highest. You can take six. Six. Ooh. Yeah, and then my rocket spear. Missed. So, three. See, it was worth it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I will not rock it. Yeah. Charge in. Yeah. Unfailable. Oh, 11, you're okay. Yeah, I think you've just made that. Just made that. Just made that one. So four attacks, you said. Four attacks. I've got my four. Okay. Reroll and misses. Well, what I'm going to do is pay one CP. Okay. To explode sixes. Oh, very nice. Against chaos. Yeah, all right, yeah. It's, uh, every hit is three hits. Brilliant. Yeah, that sounds fair. I'm glad you've got that strategy. Okay. I've, I was really Reroll excited. Everything. To see these knights because they've been sat on behind me for ages and now we've seen them and I don't think I want to see them again. <laughs> so they can stay on that, then go back straight on that Re shelf. Reroll on everything for craft. Yep, and that's okay. And I get an extra two. So I want take that one out. Okay. This is wind on twos. Okay. Cool. Minus four. Okay, cool. Oh, so does ten, it ten damage each. Ten damage each, yeah. I think ten it's ten damage each. So oh. yeah. Does it explode? No. Well, that's the game then, Aaron. Wow. There we have it. So, scores on the doors. Aaron is going to score at the end of the game. So... He'll score 90. Uh, sorry, 95. 94. 94, because of scramblers, and I dropped, dropped one uh, engage. Oh, okay, you'll drop an engage point. Um, and do I have enough points for you to clear 15 on Big Bring It Down? Oh, no. So let's count that up. One, two, three, four. So they're... I'm on 14 already. They're two points each. Two, four, six, eight. And then that's another nine points. Yeah, so you're yeah. easily going to get 15 yeah. there. You've dropped one point on engage. So you're going to get 94 points. Mm, and you'll max the secondary. And I am going to score probably 10 for painted. You... No, Big. Steve, you've you got six points on bringing it down. i got six points on I think you've got a bit more. I think you've got eight points to bring it down, because I've got four minutes wow. off the you, table. You've got Treat eight. myself to yeah. 18 points, guys. There we have it. Yeah. So Chaos wow. Knights, a little bit OP at the moment. <laughs> fair yeah. Say. It's fair yeah. to say, yeah. Um, it, yeah, the turn one, my turn one with things so bad shocker. was just kind of not... Didn't really bring me back in the game, did it? No, no. Um, and um, then we had some bonkers, crazy stuff with exploding in... Stuff like that. That so, was, um, yeah, that, that exploding over there. I, lo I love it when just explosions go and explode more. It's, it's great. Mm. Um, yeah. Maybe not for you. Not so much for me. No. Yeah. But yeah, there we have it, guys. What do you think? Yeah. These, these four jaw boys are pretty tasty, aren't they? Yeah, I, I think they're incredible. Yeah. Um, Quite nice, aren't they? They are very nice. And, and the thing is, as well, um, that we've not seen in this game is that they get their sweep attack with that claw. Is uh, flat three damage. Oh, you got more rules. Yeah. Ah, cool. Flat three damage. What we didn't see was even better rules. Yes. <laughs> um, so That's when you do it. apply that exploding sixes to it and yeah. you're rerolling everything, um, pretty good. That's what you're saying. Pretty good, even with that. Yeah. Mm. Three flat damage. Doing a lot to this matter, I think. I think we probably should have looked at the lists prior. Uh, yeah, I agree. I think so. And I th with your with the amount uh, when, I, when I saw how many Helvins you've got with the uh, with the thermal. I was like, yeah. ah, turn one is going to be a problem. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. Yes. So uh, we probably should have looked at this a little bit differently. Mm -hmm. um, I should have definitely tailored. <laughs> <laughs> Gone first and not whiffed, I yeah. think, yeah. yeah. But look, it was a monster mash. We knew it was yeah. going to happen. Yeah. It, it's it's going to be brutal one way or the yeah. other, I think, with this sort of game. Absolutely. Um, um, I think this game would be interesting to see if 
I went first. Because I think if I, I think if I can go first and I can do something, because this guy here, I mean, out of the three times he'd fired his 2d6 guns, I had a not. three, a five, and a yeah. three, yeah. which is just awful. And I yeah. think you only failed one, you only ever failed one invulnerable save, and that was on Overwatch mm. just then. It was, yeah. So I think if I can, that's not reliable. Like you can't go to an event thinking, yeah, well, my guy just doesn't, yeah, you can shoot your double thermal at him. Yeah. You still need to try and keep out of range, do all those things normally. Um, and I think, yeah, that could have been a bit different. Could I have played it any differently? I don't know. Um, could I have gone for different secondaries? Grind was the right choice for me, I think. Yeah, because um, I, I, at the end of the day, did have more of the smaller knights. Because I can't um, scramble, I can't banners. You've also got the little infantry units, which I was yeah. hoping, if I can go first, maybe pick up one, makes yeah. my life a bit easier. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, I don't I know. think um, if I was taking this list forward, Definitely need more scions to be able to reliably stay alive for the first uh, one, the for first the first hit. deploy scramblers. Yeah. I've always said that if you're going to do deploy scramblers, you really need to, to have a. And we saw it on on Saturday. Um, lost it because I, I was just screened out way too much. Yeah. These scions with a five inch deep strike makes that a lot easier. But um, you've just got to be careful with with artillery. Yeah. Is, is the main thing. So absolutely. Um, yeah, bit of balance in there. But I think this is. Good ones to take forward, I think. Yeah, it's good, good game. Yeah, good game, mate. Nice list, mate. Okay. Are you interested to see what so, uh, we again. can do with... I think, yeah, I'd love to br you see this, bring this list back again. Mm. Play some other lists. Into yeah, it. yeah, maybe some of the uh, some of the big hitters, potentially. The some 90s craft world, that will have you. And, yeah. And the My ones. Howling Banshees, mate. Yeah. They will tear this apart. Yeah. I'm telling you now. <laughs> yeah. As long as I roll sixes. What if I roll sixes? I think the Grey Knights would give it a good go. <laughs> Is that a challenge? <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll use the ultramarines if we're playing. I'm oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. uh, yeah. just going to count all the aggressors that eradicates that game, okay? Yeah. 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 Uh, yeah. Anyway, Aaron, thanks so much for coming on the show. No, thank Jake, you. Jake, thank you very much for being in the chat. Always, it's always fun. Obviously, not as long as normal, but I think that was just a... Just a quick 20-minute game. Yeah. That, that yeah. was an hour and 48 minutes. Is it daylight outside? It yeah. will still be daylight outside. <laughs> For the first time ever, mm. we can leave yeah. in, the, in the night. Yeah, we can get a nice um, drive home. We'll be yeah. driving home today. D despite, obviously, all that, everyone had a good time. Good. Ah, oh, brilliant. Yeah. Okay. yeah, obviously, and there was a couple of little uh, rules mistakes, but that's a... Uh, first, yeah. first list for the Megaras for me, so... Yeah, the other thing as well, like, you know, we... Aaron was playing a different army two mm. days ago. Yeah. You know, in... You know, I see all the time, that, like, you know, people will comment... Oh, you got this rules wrong. You should know better, or whatever. Well, mm. we are always going to make slight mistakes. Yeah. I'd probably say we know ninety-five percent of the rules out of that are, that are out there. Yeah. Um, that are current as well is yeah. other things, you know, and especially for myself and Joe, that play test. There's other things we need to consider and think about, mm -hmm. um, and there's a lot to remember. Yeah. So we will yeah. get the odd thing, but again, just. Like we did there, we just did little go backs. Yeah, exactly. You know, exactly. and you guys that know your armies really well, you know, again, those, we, I see it from some people, they're like, oh, I think you might have got this a bit wrong. Yeah. Really nice, polite way of doing it. Yeah, yeah. And then you get other people that just go on and troll you. So um, negativity, not for us. No. Constructive no. criticism or, oh, by the way, next guys, next time guys, remember this. We will remember that. Yeah, exactly. We will, you know, make those changes. Um, so, yeah, it's all about what can sticking here when we're playing because otherwise we don't want to be looking at books all the whole time because ultimately it's going to slow down the whole process so yeah, exactly, exactly you need to take what we do in terms of the rules respect with a little bit of a pinch of salt okay not worry about it too much yeah. and as we always say if you're ever unsure on rules check with your opponent when you're at the event check you double check your rules make sure like i wouldn't run this chaos night list at a tournament Period. No, I mean, um, I, wouldn't, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't run this Chaos Knight list without having at least 10 to maybe 30 repetitions in with it exactly. before I went to a tournament. I'd have a cheat sheet, I'd have all my rules, I'd have everything printed out, I'd have little data cards for each of my knights, I've used tokens here, but I'd have something a bit better. And there would not be a rule in that codec, you can ask me, and I would memorise the fullness out of it.
Exactly. And that's kind of what we want to, you know, encourage absolutely everybody to do. We can't, we don't get the luxury to do that here. We're doing, no. you know, Take pictures, up. painting. You were still painting your army probably I, last night. Yeah, I, I built these armages. Um, I think I was up until five in the morning after oh. the stream on Saturday building armages, and I've wow. painted them since. Then, yeah, so. and you've done a great job, mate. So, Cheers, mate. yeah taking all the pictures, getting all the artwork done yeah, and all that, getting fun. the stream live. So look guys, there's always going to be little tweaks, but we do appreciate those positive comments, not so much the negative ones, but I hope you enjoyed it nonetheless. And we'll see you next Tuesday with another live stream game. I'm not sure what it's going to be or who it's going to be yet. Uh, maybe it'll be Jake back on stream. Could be, could be Joe and Jake. The people oh, want nice. it. The people want it. <laughs> They wanted Joe versus Jake. No, I'm just saying that. They probably want Joe. I'm just a added extra. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah could be something like that. Got, we've got some new Necrons to mm. show off. Yeah, they're looking great. Yeah, we're going to finish painting off. So it's probably going to be Necrons next week versus something else. We might even have Space Wolf soon. Yeah. Death yeah. Watch soon. These Ooh. are the armies that are work in progress. And again, it's all thanks to your help with the Super Chats and stuff really helps us speed us along with that. We've got a monolith to show you. We've got uh, 12 of the Orphidian Wraiths to bring on the channel. Um, so they're literally being painted up tomorrow morning um, and getting those finished. But yeah, again, check out the Academy if that's something you're, you're interested in. And uh, all the links to that are below. So again, thanks so much, Aaron. Thanks Thank so much, Jake. Cheers. Pleasure as always. Thanks so much for you, Joe, doing what you're doing, painting in there. <laughs> and um, we'll see you guys next Tuesday. See you later. Cheers, guys.